Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I know that I had recently posted on Instagram that I was going to be posting another video right after the sister tag, but it kind of took a little bit and I'll explain why in a little bit when we get into the video. Anyways, welcome back. I am so happy that I am filming again. I had mentioned in my last video that I had bought three different tripod tripods, sorry, and um I'm just excited because now I have something to hold my phone and I don't have to, you know, do all this propping and blah, 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 blah. So I am so excited to be doing this video. It is going to be my current favorite items, whether it be makeup, body, just whatever I'm using right now. This is what I'm loving and I just thought I'd share it with you guys. I'm not going to call it like a June favorite or a July favorite because some of these items I've actually been using since February, but I've waited to make a video about them because I just want to be sure that I love them before I share it with you guys. I don't want to share anything that I'm like on the fence about or I would just make a video about products that I'm hating. <laughs> so without further ado, don't forget to subscribe because it's free so why not and click the little bell next to the subscribe button so that you are notified every time i post a new video okay so the first items i am going to talk about have to do with the body whatever i am sorry i have a video or a chat trying to come through my phone right now and I'm just gonna keep on moving because I'm trying to get this done anyway so the first items have to do with the body and I've probably have had these for a few weeks and the only reason why I'm sharing them is because I loved them right away the first one is a self tan that you can do at home and it's by I don't know if it's st. Morris I don't professional st. Morris professional I'm not sure but it looks like this and it's a fast tan 60 minute tan and depending on how many hours you wait one two or three is you know you're going it's going to determine how dark you're gonna get and it's streak free fast activating and dermatologically dermatologically dermato you know what I mean tested anyways so it does come with a little mitt, which I forgot to grab, but well, it actually doesn't come with one. You have to buy it separately, and I think it's about seven or eight bucks, but it's worth it because if you try to put this on without a mitt, your hand is gonna be dark, okay? And I don't even know how easy it is to get off because you kind of have to like rub it in. Now, I'm kind of going backwards here. The second item is this Shea Moisture 100% Virgin Coconut Oil ground coffee scrub that is a long title anyways I was kind of worried because I love to drink coffee but I don't always like the smell of coffee as weird as that sounds like coffee beans like a strong smell like when you go into Starbucks and it's so strong sometimes I'm like oh my gosh like I can't it's too much but anyways this scrub is amazing you guys the first time I used it my skin was soft I'm not even over exaggerating like baby booty soft okay and it kind of was a little rough because it is an exfoliator you're removing like all the dead skin and I even like used it on my face I did up here I did my belly my back what I could reach I did my legs and my feet you guys I felt like a whole new woman I am not kidding so I recommend getting a really good scrub and then using your self tanner and then I would just use like some lotion around my knuckles and my ankles and my toes and all that so that it wasn't like super dark in those areas, you know, and then I would like use it lightly around those areas as well. So these two items I am loving and I know that I haven't had them very long, but I am sharing them with you guys because I don't think that there is going to be anything in the future that I'm going to hate about them. So once again, it's the ground coffee scrub by Shea Moisture. And then the St. Maurice Professional or St. Maurice, I don't know. Anyways, that's it. And I really like it. And this one was probably a decent brand. Um, I don't think I paid more than 10 bucks for this bottle. I was originally going into Ulta for the, the Loving Tan, which you can see all over YouTube of girls trying it out and they love it. And that's what I wanted. But that particular store didn't carry it. So I was like, well, you know what? why not go a little cheaper and see how this works out 
Okay, so I received a call. Unfortunately, I'm filming I'm filming on my phone. So when a call comes in, it completely stops my video and I have to start over. But anyways, I went a little bit cheaper to see if I liked it and I ended up loving this. Um, that's why I'm sharing it. I highly recommend it. And if you guys give it a try, let me know. Let me know how you like it because I am really satisfied with this. But eventually I will get the Loving Tan because not only does it have super good reviews but i am super picky about what i put on my body you guys i'm sure you guys are too but like i get so nervous trying out new products and i was even hesitant about this i'm like ah is right now the best time to be going cheap but it worked out in my favor this time so these two i love okay the next one is kind of just one item in a small category this is like I guess we could put it in the home category um, it's the botanical therapy calming pillow spray in the scent of lavender now I received this as a birthday gift last month my birthday okay so I received it as a birthday gift and I was super excited to try it out because I am all about something that will like help me sleep better I sprayed this all over my bed you guys my pillows my sheets my comforter even in the room I was just going spray crazy and I swear I slept so good and I was like no freaking way a spray did that to me right so my boyfriend had to happen to be gone that night and he was out late usually I can't sleep that well when he's gone this you guys was the reason why I slept so well and shout out to Danielle because she put the cutest little box together for my birthday and this was one of the items and I love it and I've told her like thank you so much for this stuff because you did not have to get all this for me but I'm definitely putting it to you so I highly recommend some kind of spray mainly in the lavender scent because that's what's calming you know um, if you guys have a spray that you use let me know because I'll probably try that out too but I did really like this okay the next category is hair okay so let's start with the most like the higher up brand so i have the redken shampoo and conditioner it's the extreme one and it's this blue bottle and with the pump so i had got this a few months back from ulta when they were having well actually it probably was no it wasn't this one i paid full price for this i think <laughs> anyways the Redken Shampoo and Conditioner, I highly recommend if you're trying to use a professional brand or if you have like color treated hair. Um, this is the Extreme and it's probably one of the best ones like out of all the colors you can select from to use. Um, this says it's a fortifier for distressed hair. So I have thick hair, I have wavy hair. It used to be curly before I got it thinned out. I've been having it thinned out for years now so I don't have those same curls but being that i do color my hair i have to be careful about like what with what i'm putting in my hair as far as shampoo conditioner products and stuff and this shampoo you guys is really really good highly recommend it um you can get it at ulta you can get it at pretty much any salon um if you're willing to spend the extra money because i think they're like almost 25 dollars a bottle but once a year ulta does a sell where they're selling these for like 15.99 each which to me is a steal so stock up right now what's actually going on now if you're looking for a cheaper alternative that is still good i was the test dummy okay i had went to walmart and i came across this maui moisture it's the shampoo and conditioner it's for strength and anti-breakage for chemically damaged hair obviously when you color your hair you're, you're putting some damage on it right so you want to use some good stuff it says smooth heal and quench and it's uh silicone free and i think there's no mineral oil no silicones no parabens no gluten no sls not sure what that is no sulfated surfactants which is the ingredient that they put in shampoos and conditioners to make it like get all um bubbly and like soapy and you know help lather it up i learned that in chemistry by the way uh no synthetic dyes no a-L-E-S? I don't know what that is. Uh, it says, yes, it's vegan. Yes, it's eco-friendly. Yes, it's pure coconut water. Yes, pure aloe juice. 
anyways you guys this is only like five bucks a bottle at walmart and i just noticed that ulta carries it because i saw it in their little magazine they put out but um i was like so <laughs> nervous to try this again i went cheap i like to try things but i still get nervous just like anybody else would um I went cheap and I wasn't let down you guys this stuff my hair was so soft it rinsed out so easy now again there's no uh, sulfate stuff in it which makes it all sudy and soapy um, so I, I kind of took a little bit to get used to because that is in this this does lather up like really well so I was like oh my gosh is it working kind of thing and it worked i loved it my hair was soft it wasn't tangly it wasn't it didn't feel dry or coarse or anything this stuff i highly recommend if you're on a budget and you have color treated hair i know professional shampoos professional products they all get expensive i know it's a lot to keep up on your hair but this stuff will not let you down um if you give it a try let me know because i want to know how it works for other people again i have thick hair i have wavy hair it is color treated so I love these and I will be repurchasing again because this stuff is good to have like as a backup if you run out of your expensive stuff you got this stuff so I love those uh, we're gonna go into the face so I had bought this vanity planet uh, spin brush back in February I believe and I had made a February favorites video, but I didn't want to share it because I hadn't been using it long enough. So this brush, I believe, is like over a hundred dollars. And you may be like, holy moly. Yeah, I know. But I mean, there's Clarisonic and those things are expensive, too. So this thing was over a hundred dollars. But because I um I am like a faithful watcher of KK and Baby J. You guys may be familiar with them karen had shared her discount code and kind of like went through you know how she uses it and i used her discount code so i did not pay over a hundred dollars for this this that discount code was a steal on this brush so it's from vanity planet like i said it does open up like this it's a little spot for your brush you need to get three different spin brushes this is your exfoliating one this is for like um sensitive skin it's just kind of like rubbery and then you have like an everyday brush that looks like this. It is wet because I use it every day. Um, I just put my soap on there and then I put it on my face. I'm trying to touch my face a lot less. And then there's like, that's setting one and then setting two. Water's going everywhere. My batteries are getting kind of low so it will be time to change. But when you have fresh batteries, this thing is spinning on your face, guys. So be careful but i love it because it removes like every single ounce of makeup on my face now i do use like a a makeup remover wipe before i do that but sometimes those don't get everything this gets what's left behind and it works so good no this is not a sponsored video i did not reach out to them um i just really love this and i was not let down and i think it also comes in purple and blue so I do highly recommend this. There's a lot of like other videos on YouTube that you can find where they're doing reviews on this. Um, I honestly didn't even watch one single review before I bought this. I had only saw what Karen did on her channel and I was like, oh my gosh, I love that. And plus it was super cute and it's like anything that comes in like cute packaging, I'm a sucker for it. So that's the spin brush. Okay, the next two items, I recently shared one of them on Instagram when I said, hey, I have a video coming out about this, like keep your eyes out. So it's from Coco Kind. I have the rose water facial toner. <laughs> and I have my baby running. Hi, Papa. You wanna say hi? Say hi. Yay. So I have the rose water toner and then I also have the organic chia facial oil again these were both gifts for my birthday that came in the same box with this uh, lavender spray that again shout out to danielle she got me she put this amazing box together you guys i wish i could have like shown you but of course i was so excited i just like woo, wanted to see what she got me so this rose water toner Within 24 hours of my first use, I am not even lying to you guys, I saw a difference like that in my face, the texture, everything. After the toner, I used this facial oil. I don't know if the 
can focus. But it's the same brand. Now, I was nervous because I have combination skin. I get very oily in my T-zone. I break out a lot around my chin. I'm sure you guys can see I have something now. Um, I was very nervous to use it. And when I came home later on in the evening after work, I was like washing my hands in the bathroom. And I was like, oh my God, this is my face. Like, what? Like, what? Like, I was in shock, you guys. And I was like, what happened? I was like these products i use them on my face and immediately i was like texting danielle like i freaking love these right and it turns out that she had recommended them to other people because they were having some skin issues and it's helped them it's really helped her and now it's helping me dedicated dedicated to this product i am not joking you guys i have never fallen in love with a facial product probably like ever so what you doing so again I, this highly recommending now i will be honest i did reach out to the company letting them know that you know i fell in love with these products in 24 hours okay in love with them you know asking if there was any other information that they could give me so that i could share with you guys unfortunately i did not get a response back um I know that every company is busy and they probably, you know, they just can't respond to everybody right away, which is fine. But um, I did write a few things down about these items. The rose water toner, it softens and soothes, soothes, softens and soothes your skin. I can definitely agree with that because my skin is just like a baby's butt and it reduces your dryness. Now, I'm like I said I have combination skin so I don't always get too dry but if I do wash my face and I forget to put moisturizer on I do kind of get dry in here so using this even with if I forget to do this the facial oil I'm good I'm still good for the day and it refreshes and balances the pH level in your skin now obviously I can't go into like details about that because I don't know a lot about pH balance, but I could almost say like, yeah, you know what? I freaking believe it because in 24 hours after one use, I didn't use it day and night. I only used it in the morning and within 24 hours, there was a complete difference. And I even went the next day to my parents and I was like, Danielle got me these products. I freaking love them. Like, do you notice a difference? And it happened to be when my sister was visiting and she was like, yeah, like you have a glow. I'm like, these. Now, this rose water does come in a travel size. So why not buy the travel size and try it out? And if you really like it, get the full size. I'm so lucky she got me this. This is $17 on their website. Now, the Coco Kind Chia Facial Oil, there is a significant source of omega-3 fatty acids. Now, at first I was like, fatty acids on my face? But it works, so I'm going to use it. It also protects and nourishes your skin, probably just from like the elements that you're around from day to day. And you just have to use two to three drops, one to two times daily. I only use it in the morning because I don't want to put too much oil on my face. And then like it caused me to break out. And when I do wear it, because I do break out a lot on my chin more than any other place on my face. Oh, I'm so itchy, sorry. Um, I just avoid my chin and I go from like here up. So these two products, you guys, like I wanted to do a whole video on them by themselves. But I was like, really, really? So I just included it in this video all skin types good for all skin types um i'm gonna link everything that i'm talking about down below and let me know if you guys try them you guys please let me know because i can sit here and rave about these products but like i don't know if they work for anybody else unless you guys give me feedback and that's okay if they don't because what works for me may not necessarily work for you we're all different we have different skin different things going on but i would love to know your guys' take on these items. Okay, so we'll move into makeup. I have two items that I want to share. One is, well, probably both are like all over the internet. But for me, being that I don't always wear makeup, I prefer just to go natural like this. Like, I barely even wear mascara, and I'm sure you can't even tell that I'm wearing it now. Um, 
these two items I really am loving. And the first one is by Anastasia. It's the collab with Amrezy. Now, I've followed her on Instagram for so long. And I think I try to find her on YouTube, but I don't think she does YouTube videos. If she does, let me know. Anyways, she came out with this highlighter. And look how beautiful that is. You guys, I was so hesitant to get it because I'm like, I do not be doing all of that stuff on my face. But... I do like to have a few good highlighters in this one. I love you guys. Love, love, love. Look at that. I don't know if you can tell. I don't know. I'm not in the best lighting right now, but I mean, from what I can see, I can see it on my, on my skin. It's just so pretty. Like I put it on my face. Oh, shit. Woo. Let's make the other side match. I'm doing this in my phone you guys don't judge me I am NOT one of those beauty gurus at all so this I do like this highlighter now my sister got me started on the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna the foundation she was mixing it in with another foundation I was like damn girl that looks good and so she was like it's this it's this and I mix it with this and I do this and da -da -da. you know my sister is like into makeup she beats that face in like 5 10 maybe 15 minutes but um I went a few days later to Sephora and I bought this and I think it was like 20 bucks. I can't remember. Um, but I'm sure you guys have heard about this because it is all over YouTube. Same with the highlight. But this, I bought it and I used it that night when we filmed the sister tag. And my sister was like, why are you doing your makeup? And I was like, I really want to try it out. And I didn't know what the lighting was going to look like when we filmed that video. So I was like, let me just throw this on really quick. So, um, it is, it says pro filter, soft matte, long wear foundation, shake well, and it's how many ounces? One, a little over an ounce. Yeah. And this is in the shade 200. Um, it went on so good. I used a beauty blender by, I think it's real techniques, that orange one with like the flat edge. I used that to apply it and it went on so good and I was like I just kept looking at my face and I'm like dang this looks good and then I was like getting excited to really do my makeup one day which I'm gonna be honest I haven't really done too much um but I want to start we all want to start doing things it's just whether or not you're really going to get to it but um I really do like this foundation after one use I was like definitely will repurchase if I ever finish this bottle so there's that one and then the last category is just the whatever category. Um, things that I've been using, things that I love. Now, I don't know if you follow me, if you're my friend on Facebook, um, but I have been more active on Instagram and I've kind of been sharing my love for Starbucks. Now, I know not everybody loves them. That's okay. I know they can be pricey. Trust me, I understand, but I love Starbucks, and one thing I really love about them is the cups that they come out with. Now, I don't believe I've shared this one on my channel. This was a Christmas gift from my mother-in-law. It's this Starbucks cup, and it's kind of like coppery, and I was just like, oh my gosh, like it's beautiful, and it's $23. This is a venti size, so it's probably like 20 ounces, I'm assuming. Yeah. But um, I know that they can be a little pricey, but honestly, like, I almost feel like it's worth it because, sorry, because you're going to go in Starbucks, order your coffee, and you're either getting a plastic cup or the, like, you know, the hot paper cups. I just like having this because I'm like, oh, I have my cup. Oh, I have my cup. And I use this for everything, whether it be tea, water. I don't drink pop. I don't drink juices, but you could put it in here if you really wanted to. So I have this one. My a cup that I don't have here, but I do have is the all matte black one. I love that one. Beautiful. And then when my sister was here, I had her pick me up this hot pink one. You guys, this is so freaking cute. And it's not your normal lid. It's like a thinner one as these ones look a little different. If you can see what I'm saying. Um, and then it's just silver on the inside and there's just water in there. But, um, I think this one was probably like 25 but I freaking I love these cups you guys they are good for anything you go anywhere just grab your cup fill it up with whatever you need I try to always keep water with me because I'm trying to drink more water these cups you guys I was talking about it when my sister was here I was like 
I would really love to do a collab with Starbucks because they have all these cups, right? But then obviously I'm a mom, I have my son, and I go and I purchase all these kid cups trying to find something that is spill proof and leak proof. And I'm like, if I could do a collab with Starbucks and come up with a line of kid cups that really are spill proof and leak proof, if that's even at all possible to make, you guys, my dreams would so come true so come true let starbucks know for me because that is an idea of mine and i don't know if any other mom has thought the same thing but if you have i'm thinking with you trust me i would love to collab with them but um that sums up my current favorites um I'm so glad that I finally got to film this video and I cannot wait to post it for you guys. And I just wanna thank you so much for watching my videos. I know that I'm still a small channel. I probably only have like 24 or something like that subscribers, but I love doing this and I love being able to sit down in front of the camera and talk to you guys. And it's, it's still kind of new for me and I get a little nervous, but I'm enjoying it so far. Um, one thing I do want to ask is if when you guys watch the video if you can comment down below what you want to see Because there's so many tutorials on things my morning routines people cleaning their kitchens my nighttime routines with my kids You know like everybody has stuff like that. I really want to know what you guys want to see and I will do my best to film it um, I love being able to engage with you guys and I know uh, some people that I went to school with have recently watched my videos and it makes me so happy because on YouTube there is so much content to watch and you're taking time out of your day to watch my video that just really means a lot to me but anyways I'm gonna stop rambling um, there oh shoot I forgot about a category real quick you guys because i had everything on this side of me that i wanted to share that i forgot about a few things so there were a few pieces of clothing that i'm loving so real quick this is one from target and the back has a little cute little thing crisscross and it's just kind of like a summery shirt it's really cute i'll show you guys like look and it's kind of flowy depending on the size that you get but I am really loving this shirt and I also had got it in black because obviously black goes with anything. So this is the front and this is the back and it's just kind of flowy and summery and cute. And I think I had actually posted a video, I mean not a video, a picture on Instagram. Okay, my second one, I got this for Christmas and I swear I still try to wear it in the summer and I'm like, girl, you're crazy, don't. But it's this vest and I believe it's from JCPenney's it's so comfy you guys and like it's really cute with a turtleneck or just a regular long sleeve super cute you can wear it with anything bit and brittle i think that's what it's called and i have it in an extra large it's really comfy and it kind of tightens around your waist there aren't any strings to make it tighter but that's just what it looks like and honestly it's just a cute mom vest i really love that and last but not least, I'm sure you guys have probably heard of them. The Ace Family Jersey. Okay, I wasn't going to get one because honestly, they are a little pricey. But I don't buy YouTube merch a lot. And so I wanted my first YouTube merch purchase to be from the Ace Family. So I had bought the women's jersey. Jersey? jersey white red it's super cute you guys it's like super soft look at look at what they did with the little details like you got to pay attention to the details and you have to really appreciate it or else you know if you're not like a follower or subscriber of theirs don't buy it but like they just did such cute things and it's so comfy and i've only worn it once and i'm really trying to put a cute outfit together for it but um this is one of my favorite items because it's like it's thin it's not a thick material but you can wear this with jeans and some vans some sandals whatever you wanted but i just wanted to share those few pieces of clothing um i talked a little bit about everything body home hair the face just products that i'm using like the starbucks cups um that sums it up 
I had to include the clothing part. Sorry, guys. So that sums up this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed filming it. Um, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Join the family. Um, I will see you guys in my next video. See you soon. Bye.